Thank you very much. Uh, I think uh, we're here on the staff. Coming to the first game, I think everything is possible. And I did pretty good in Nigeria. Uh, so scored one, uh, which I think even has a chance as well of uh, scored. And uh, I think uh, we did well for the first game. I think, uh, the boys did well despite me. It's painful to lose a game like this, uh, of which I think uh, it's only God knows uh, we're still in the competition. Football, uh, it's a present thing, uh, which I think we have seen some mistakes, of so which we have to go and control them in training. In order to come against South Africa, that the team will be ready. Uh, I think the mistakes there will, be, will always be there, but I think we have seen where we are lacking. And uh, coming to the next game against South Africa, I think you're going to see an improvement. It wasn't a uh, physical aspect. Uh, I think physically we're okay. If you have seen towards the end, even Nigeria looked a bit tired. We could have even scored uh, two or three goals, uh, of which I think it was just tactical change. We saw how Nigeria were exposed at the back, of which I think we have to make the changes. I said to you before the match that uh, we were talking at the corridor and I told you, I said the African football has developed a lot and uh, CAF has done a lot to make the game very, very strong at the very youth level. This is an example of another game that represents the final of the Cup of Nations and I hope that all the games can be like this. Uh, the lessons led into this match are so many. Why? Because you can see that we created a lot of chances, but we weren't able to convert. And the ones, the one that we converted was clearly offside. Uh, some of the passes that we made were in, some of the pocket passes that we gave were incorrect. Most of those balls were caught. So we, when we're talking about the youths, development is the thing that we're talking about. You must be expecting a lot of errors. And uh, but I thank God today that uh, the game was wonderful. The game was very difficult for us. At the end of the day, we got the victory, minus the penalty that we lost. With due respect to all the teams that came for this competition, it's very, very important your first match because, you know, youth, youth football is built and ruled by psychology, not the technicalities or tactical discipline or the physical conditioning that you put in place sometimes or all the information that you give is purely psychological. So you can see it today with a lot of wrong passes and me shouting on the line. This represents a going forward. So that at the end of the day, if we can win one more match, then we are guaranteed for the, uh, let's say, quarterfinals. And at the end of the day, if we win the quarterfinals, we've qualified for the World Cup, and we go ahead, get into the finals. If we can win our last match, then automatically we can win the trophy. But if you don't win the last match, you don't win the trophy. Uh, the nations of the world that had, I was, I was a footballer then myself, playing. When I heard about the crash, I was very, very saddened because uh, it's a thing that doesn't happen so often except for just the natural ones. But uh, that Zambia was able to raise a team again to go to, was it Morocco to play then and then lost, was a very wonderful thing. So this game, no matter how tough, it is for 30 years the victory is dedicated to those that died and the ones that are living and today those that are representing zambia in this competition and thanks to CAF, I, I think i would have to change my mind saying that nigeria is the favorite team we've always been the favorite team everywhere we go because at this level we won the competition in the world five times and qualified maybe two times more to the finals of the under 17 world cup i seated here was the first person in the world that will lift the under 17 world cup in china 1985 i was the captain of the team so it won't be bad if we have the opportunity this time around being the favorite and winning the competition as well